we're brewing a pumpkin ale. Finally found the pumpkin. We got two small pumpkin pies. They're called sweet pie pumpkins or some crazy name like that. Anyways, we're gonna take our grains and what I'm gonna be using is uh, two row. We're gonna use nine pounds of that. We're gonna use a pound and a quarter of Munich malt. I have half a pound of American wheat and I have a quarter pound of Crystal 40 Lovey Bond. Um, I couldn't find East Kent Golden uh, hops, so I went for Cascade hops instead. These are 5.5% alpha acid. I got two ounces here. I'm gonna be using California Ale Yeast, WLP001. And to spice off the pumpkin, I am going to be using ground nutmeg, pumpkin pie spice, and all ground spice along with cinnamon. We start off by making a yeast starter. Bring one quart of water to a boil, take 100 grams of dry malt extract, add it to the water, and boil for 12 minutes. Cool it. Add to the Erlenmeyer flask, back to the pot. Back to the Erlenmeyer flask, this is a rating to work. Pitch your yeast. Waste no yeast. Let it drip. Place aluminum foil over the Erlenmeyer flask and give it a swirl. Store it at 68 degrees for 12 to 24 hours or until you see foam start to form on top. That's when you're ready to pitch. Begin by cutting your pumpkins. Scoop out all the seeds and place your pumpkins over aluminum foil in a cooking sheet. Place the pumpkins in an oven at 300 degrees and bake for two hours. Begin dumping your grains into your mash tun. Bring the temperature of your mash to 134 degrees at a ratio of one quart of water per pound of grain. Stir your mash, make sure all the grains are soaking evenly. Rest for 20 minutes and then bring the temperature of the mash up to 156 degrees at a ratio of 1 and 3 quarter quarts of water per pound of grains. Make any water adjustments as necessary. Make sure you stir your wort. Rest this for 60 minutes, always keeping the mash temperature above 152 degrees. Make sure you collect about a quart of wort until the runnings are clear. At that point, take whatever you collect and add it back to the mash and continue to lauder. In the meantime, we're getting the pumpkin out of the oven. Do a pumpkin flip. Begin scooping out all the pulp out of the pumpkins. Don't forget to sparge as you're scooping out the pulp out of the pumpkins. Once you're done laudering and sparging, bring everything up to a boil. Make sure that it's a slow rolling boil. Once you get the rolling boil going, start adding your pumpkin. And give it a little stir. Begin counting down 90 minutes from here on out. Make any water adjustments as necessary at this point. And when you have six minutes left in the boil, start adding one ounce of Cascade hops and make sure that you stir. Then when you have 15 minutes left in the boil, add another half an ounce of Cascade hops, give it another stir. When you have five minutes left in the boil, start adding all of your spices. 
Make sure you give all of that a stir. Boil for another five minutes. By now it should smell delicious. And now it's time to cool down the wort. Turn off the heat, get your wort chiller into the pod, cool it down to yeast pitching temperature and begin collecting all of your wort. Use a strainer, not so much to keep all the uh, trub and the pumpkin out, but to create a spraying effect which will aerate the wort. Make sure that you actually throw in the pumpkin into the fermenter and I also threw in my hops as well. Finally, we pitch our yeast and the beer is born. Cover it up, give it a little shake to mix things up. Begin fermenting this beer at 66 degrees. When your airlock starts bubbling, start to increase the temperature two degrees at a time every 24 hours. So move up to 68 degrees, 24 hours later move up to 70 degrees, then 72 degrees. You'll see airlock activity increase a little bit and then you're gonna end up at 74 degrees. Then slowly bring that temperature down to 60 degrees to cold condition the beer for a week or two. Stay tuned for the tasting of the beer and see how this came out. Hope you enjoy. Don't forget to like, comment, and share this video. Like, just like, just, just randomly like, combine right? caramel, malt, mm -hmm. hops, and you're fine. Yeah. <laughs> Let's do it. All right, that's that. We'll see. We're missing two.